Welcome to this uh, topic, it's called elapsed time. So elapsed time is the time or difference between a beginning time and an end time. So we've got an example here of two clocks that you can see with Roman numerals there. How much elapsed time between the time on the two clocks? So how much of the time has been elapsed between these two particular clocks? So first of all, let's have a look at solution one. Um, so the start time that you can see here is, uh, let me just write this down for you. So we can see that it's four o'clock. So it's 4, 40 um, in terms of the beginning clock. So the start clock, okay? So that's the start and that's the finish. Start and finish time, okay? So here, just remember, let me just note this down for you. So we've got 5, 10, 15, 20, 25 minutes, 30 minutes, 35 minutes, 40 minutes, 45 minutes, uh, 50 minutes, and 55 minutes, and then we have 60 minutes at the top. Now, this applies to the entire clocks because five means five past the hour, 10 means 10 past the hour, 15 minutes means 15 minutes past the hour, and so on and so on. So the first time that we have, we can see is 4.40 because the shorthand is just gone past four and before five and the long hand or the big hand, in other words, is pointing to 40, so it's 4.40. Now we don't know whether it's AM or PM, but in this case, we'll just kind of pretend that it's 4.40 AM. So, and the finish time that we can see here is going to be 4.55 a.m. Okay, because there's five minutes left until five o'clock. Now, because we have these two times of 4.45, take away 4.40. Now we need to work out the difference between 4.55 and 4.40. So from 4.40, let me count up in fives, five minutes up to 4.55. So let's start with 4.40 first of all. So 4.40 plus five minutes is 4.45. 4.45 plus five minutes is 4.50, and 4.50 plus five minutes is 4.55. So I've got three times five here, which means the difference is going to be 15 minutes in total between these two clocks, 15 minutes in total. And that's the elapsed timing from the start time to the finish time. And elapsed means how much time has gone past or how much time difference is there between the start time and the finish time. And that's exactly what you'll need to do with the rest of the question. So you can see the first clock here. The first clock says uh, four, four o'clock. And the second clock says 4.30. So how much time has elapsed between four o'clock and 4.30, so how many minutes difference in between, all right? So in this case, we can see that four o'clock to 4.30, the difference is 30 minutes in total, or in other words, half an hour, okay? So have a look at this, read the image again one more time, and uh, good luck with the rest of the questions, and we'll follow these up as normal in our next class. Thank you.